Hello Alex, I hope you're feeling recovered, but in case you're not, I think this slower paced Manny is a good thing for this week. So John's video on Vlogbrothers was all about sunsets, part of his sunset series, I love that name. But it really got me thinking about sunrises, and I thought it might be nice to kind of show you one from where I am. That you can watch at any time, and not just when the sun is actually rising. It was kind of foggy today when I took this. It really changed the light, I think, and the way the colors kind of bleed from one another. Uh, I think the art history term for this is like sfumato, maybe? But, you know, I am a took one art history course kind of person. Not a real art history nerd, unfortunately. I was thinking about the points you made about how um, there being particular like, qualities or styles in art makes us want to emulate those things if those are like styles we're really drawn to. The way you want to sing One Direction songs and you don't really care about singing Ed Sheeran songs, for example. I really like how clearly you managed to focus on that point, because if I think about it, that is sort of something I've also experienced. Like, part of the reason I like watching the sunrise or the sunset is that you always get this really interesting blending and bleeding together of different colors. And they sort of gradient or mix in ways that you wouldn't necessarily expect. Like, I love that this sunrise is kind of simultaneously orange and blue, but not really either one of those. And I find myself really focusing in on the same kind of blurring from one color into another in a lot of my drawings, fish or otherwise. Like, I haven't drawn a, sun a sunrise fish or a sunset fish, but it wouldn't be out of character. But yeah, I really think you're right about finding those points of connection, you know, consciously or subconsciously, being a really important thing in how sometimes art makes us want to turn around and make more art. Your stamp art, by the way, fantastic, mesmerizing, I could watch that all day. YouTube does not reflect the number of times I've watched it. I would really love to see, actually, you stamping the stamp onto something, if that's a possibility. But yeah, that video made me so happy, Alex. Talk about good art. And thanks for having the conversation with me. I'll see you later.